29th April 2023. I went for the first swim of the year with my friend Tashi. If you've stalked my YouTube channel enough, you probably know her by now. She's practically become the co-star of all my travel escapades, like my panda in crime but without the crime, of course. Or maybe not, guess you'll never know. Weather has never been supportive of my endeavors to enjoy my well-laid plans, but hey, I'm determined to seize every opportunity to have a blast, even if it means swimming in pouring rain and water so cold it could freeze a popsicle. Okay, maybe I'm slightly exaggerating on the freezing part, but you get the idea. After a refreshing swim, we headed to this cool cafe. The owner suggested we make Instagram reels, but we had a better plan. We pretended to have these deep conversations all for the sake of more content for my video and oh boy did we nail it. After that, we went to a hotel and tried to sleep as early as possible because, you know, we are busy career ladies in our 20s. So like responsible adults, we tucked ourselves in and fell asleep at 2am. Yeah, we really know how to embrace that work life balance. The next morning, I woke up with a jolt of energy that could rival a double espresso. After all, I finally got to swim after a long winter season and being around my friend Tashi is always fun. But then our roads to normalcy are diverged in opposite direction, literally. And we have stomachs to feed, our own, and clothes to buy and bank balances to increase balances <laughs> so we wait farewell until next time one of us plans something yeah bye